Okay. Is it true that gas station pumps are another way to catch the virus? I mean, they've got to be loaded with germs. Um, they are, and so you want to either use gloves that you take off or wash your hands uh, afterwards, uh, even using the, uh, if you will, the alcohol cleanser or something like that. Easiest way is obviously to use a glove or two gloves to, to do it. That's right. And it stays on. Now, it, there should be an effect of the cold. I've not seen that data um, if it's a cold pump handle, but um, it does stay on steel, which most of those are, or um, if you will, that type of metal mm -hmm. um, for about three days, up to three days. Oh, great. Now, if there's copper in it, and I don't know what it's made of, but if there's copper in it, um, it could be a much better content because copper actually kills this virus. Yeah, you would think how many people are probably using that gas handle before you. Uh, I've got one of those squeeze bottle uh, things in my car with heavy alcohol sanitizer, and that's the first thing I do after I'm done pumping gas. All right, here's the next one coming in. If washing your clothes helps kill the virus, can you just put your clothes in a hot dryer for 30 minutes to kill the virus? Is that faster, or do you have to wash the clothes first? Well, detergent is one of the best things. So just a few seconds with the detergent kills the virus. Temperature does as well, but it's 140 degrees for 15 minutes. I don't know enough about a uh, dryer cycle to know the answer to that question, but I think 15 minutes in a dryer would do it as well, and it probably gets much higher than 140 degrees in there. Um, but the detergent is a key thing. So flip them in the washer for a few seconds beforehand. All right, next uh, text question coming in. Uh, what do you say to parents of teens and young adults about hanging out at their boyfriend or girlfriend's house? Is that okay? Or should they be meeting in other places and keeping social distance? Uh, social distance is a great way. Yeah, if you knew exactly who that teen was among, that is, if it was just you and that teen and his family and that teen, mm. so that it's really a small group, essentially a big family, um, that might be okay, but you, you've got to know who he contacts with. Right. So um, you're, you're in too close with too many people, probably. 